All right, this is our live lesson for December 18th, 2019. It is noon, and it is our last week before Christmas. So Great. let's have some fun today. You guys want to have some fun? I love some trivia. Yeah, we're going to do some trivia. And remember, it is totally okay if you don't know the answer because some of these are things I never even knew. And I've been around the block for a very long time, so you'd think I'd know some things. But I do not. All right. So. Shh. We have Christmas trivia, Headbands Christmas Edition, and Christmas Riddles. Let me get my notes, because I'm a dumb dumb and didn't do that. I saw the videos. Where's my notes at? Ah! Go back. Ah, there they are. All right. So, would you guys like to do the Christmas trivia, headbands, or riddles first? So, one Christmas trivia. Shh. Show your fingers. One Christmas trivia, two headbands. Three Christmas riddles. We'll do all three, but which one do you want to do first? One, two, three. Which one? Christmas trivia. I see a one. I see a three, a one, a three, a one, a one. Okay, so we're going to do Christmas trivia. Then we'll do Christmas riddles. Then we'll do headbands. Alrighty? Okay. Oh. All oh, right, so we said trivia first, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I didn't make that up in my head. <laughs> Just saying, the song on this hat is is a really classic, mm -hmm. um, a really cra classic Rudolph. It movie. is. All right, we're going to get started. So to answer the question, raise your hand. Don't shout out. Raise your hand, okay? All right, so how many gifts would you receive if you received all of the gifts in the song, The Twelve Days of Christmas? Do you know that song? On the first day of Christmas, my true love gave to me. So how many gifts would you receive if you got all of them? 25? What did I say? Uh -uh. Nope. Mm -mm. Raise your hand. I saw Levea had a nice quiet hand. Go ahead, Levea. Wouldn't it maybe be um, uh, maybe, um 24? 24? Yeah. Nope. A lot higher than 24. Steven? I just, I was going to guess 12. You're going to guess 12? A lot higher than 12. Cassidy? Is it 28? A lot higher. Finn? 1,000. Not quite that much. So more than 28 and less than 1,000. Wyatt? Wyatt, do you want to try a guess? He said 78. 78? Oh, that's a, getting closer, but more than that. Benicia? Check my inbox. Okay, let me check my hangout. Oh, Venicia, you are close. She said 654. It's a little less than that. Cassidy, I see your hand up again. 500 or 600? Less than that. All right, I'll give you a hint. It's in the 300s. 79. So between 300 and 400. Blaine? Okay, Blaine zoned out on me. Venicia said 308. You're getting closer. Cassidy? Is it 350 or 312? 350's closer. Need to go a little higher. 
Lavea. Um, uh, maybe three hundred and sixty. You're in the ballpark, just a tiny bit more. Then. That's, that's what um, we said. It's a little bit higher. Uh, Venetia said 367. It's a tiny bit less than 367. Blaine? I said 367. Cassidy? Is it 365? A little less. Oh, I think someone said it. 364? 364. Very good. All right, next question. Hmm. Ooh, since Cassidy has on a Rudolph singing hat, <laughs> Which reindeer is Rudolph's dad? And raise your hand, don't yell out. Which reindeer? All right, Blaine. Which reindeer? Mommy. No. Ben. Blitzen. Not Blitzen. That's a good guess. It is not Dasher. It is not Comet. It is not Prancer. Lavea. You're not sure? That's okay. It is not Cupid, Venetia. Cassidy? Um, I, for, I accidentally forgot all the reindeer. <laughs> That's okay. It's not Vixen. Steven? I have no idea what... Donna! Oh, who said it? I think it was... Who said Donner? Blaine, did you say Donner? No. Very good. Whoever said Donner, good job. Well, at least I got 364, right? All right, so this one, we will do this one. Um, there is a show, and I know definitely for sure that Benicia knows, but you might not know all of it. So in the show, The Nutcracker, it's a ballet. The main character, she goes, depending on which production, she has two names. What are her names? Cassidy, your hand was up first. Is it Candy and Sweetie? Nope. Finn? <laughs> yeah, no, that's okay. Two names. Cassidy? Is it is it honey and and is it and is it violet? No. no. Venetia said Clara. That is one of the names. That's usually the main way to go, but there's also another. Most people go by Clara, but there's another name. A lot of people have this name as a middle name. Finn? It's not Buddy. Hun. Hun? Honey, no. I just said honey. Cassidy? Wait, is it Rose? No, but that's a good guess. Because I have, I have three, I have a, and a, a 
has Rose, and uh, ben? Brenda has middle name Rose. Finn, do you have a guess? Rosie? No, it's not Rosie. It starts with an M. Cassidy? Wait, is it Mary? It's not Mary. I think I heard someone say it, but they did not raise their hand. Wait, what is it? Lane, what did you say? Marie. Marie. Very good. That's my Marie. mom's middle name. Is That's it? Yeah. All right. Now let's do Mary some like riddles. Are you ready for a riddle? Yes. Play like this. I did seven second riddles all the time. All right. Same thing. You gotta raise your hand. What's all the noise? That's. I'm not sure. So I'm going to mute everyone, and that'll have. You'll have to raise your hand for me to unmute you. So that way we don't have that feedback. All right, so raise your hand. I'm watching. All right. If a lion had a Christmas music album, what would it be called? If a lion, like a jungle lion, had a Christmas music album, what would it be called? Cassidy? Um, is it Lying Rafra? No, but that, I like your thinking. No. Finn, do you have a guess? Lying Christmas. No, but that's a good guess. And I see uh, Stephen said the lion before Christmas. That's a good guess, too. No. Think of a Christmas song that you know. Cassidy? Is it Jingle Bells? You got to change it up a bit. Lion Bells? No, closer to Jingle Bells. <laughs> Jingle lion? No. Where does the lion live? Levea? Jungle, jungle. Something like that. Closer. Cassidy? Is it jungle lion? No. You guys are close, but you're mixing it up a bit. Wyatt? Jungle bell? Yes, and I just saw that Venicia just sent that too. It is Jungle Bells, and Steven sent it. Good job, guys. All right. All right, next one. Are we ready? What did the Christmas tree say to the Christmas stocking? What did the Christmas tree say? To the Christmas stocking. Then, Merry Christmas. That's a good guess, but no. Cassidy? Hmm. Is it you're running by the fireplace? You're on the right track. Steven, I like your answer, but no, it is not what's for Christmas. That's a great guess. All right, Cassidy, go ahead. Is it, are, is it you have a stocking in your stock? No, but you guys have really creative ideas. Nope. I see Steven typing, so I will let him answer. Oh, a hint. Okay, yes, Venicia. So... What does a stocking do? That's your hint. What did the Christmas tree say to the Christmas stocking? And what does a stocking do? Yes, it does hang. So what did the Christmas tree say to the Christmas stocking? Cassidy? 
You are hanging with my present. That's a good one, and you're close, but not quite. Lavea. You're hanging out with Bob. Say that one more time so I can hear you. You're hanging out with fire. Close. It is. Cassidy, I'll give you one more chance. Go ahead, honey. Is it you're hanging over Santa Claus? Mm, no. It is. Aren't you sick and tired of just hanging around? <laughs> I love it. All right. So, do you guys want to play the headband or no? Up for a yes, down for no. Down, down, kind of, sort of. Yes, yes. Okay, so I see it mostly yeses, so we'll go ahead and do that. Let me pull that up. Where are my notes? Oh, over here. So what I'm going to do I'm going to unmute you all, so please be quiet, okay? I'm going to send, I'll pick one person and send you a card, like a name, and we have to try to guess, no, 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 that's not what I'm doing. All right, so I'm going to give one of you a name, and you have to try to guess. We're going to give you clues, okay? So how about Venetia? I want you to close your eyes and don't look at what I'm doing, okay? All right, everyone else can look. I'm going to show you um, the card, and we're not going to tell Venetia what she is, but we're going to give her clues so she can try to guess it, okay? Okay. Okay, so we're going to go with this one. Okay. See this one I'm pointing at? Yeah. All right, so don't say that but we're going to give her hints, okay? Okay. All right. I know a lot about that. All right. So, Venetia, you can open your eyes, and you can ask us questions about who you are. So, for instance, you can start out with, am I a person? What? Venetia, you can go ahead and talk, honey. Sorry, my phone's ringing. So, Venetia said, am I a person? Is she a person? No. No, you're mm -hmm. not a person. Nope. I said that one. I'm not sure who's giving the feedback. Do I move? I think kind of, but, like, yeah. No. Yeah. I would, I think I know where Cassidy's going. You move in a certain way, but not like walking. Does that sound right, Cassidy? Yeah. 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 Okay, so that was two. We're going to go to five. So this is your third question you're asking. I got do, 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 do. Am I an animal? No. No. Okay, so you're not a person, you're not an animal, and you kind of sort of move. You have two more questions. Two more questions. <laughs> Mm 
Do I talk or make sounds? No. You kind of make sounds. Yeah, you make sounds, but you don't talk. Okay, I like Stephen's description. You kind of make sounds, but it's not talking sounds. Kind of make sounds. So you have one more question you can ask, then you're going to have to guess. I'm not sure if there's a TV on, but if there is, can we turn it on, please? Mother, um, I think you're causing noise. Whoever's making that noise, I do, do not. Do I hurt? Oh, so that? so that yeah. means like yeah. would no, 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 you no, like no. be hurt like a person? Oh. No. All right, Manicia, so it's time to guess. You're not a person. You are not an animal. You kind of make sounds, but you don't talk. And you, and you don't kind hurt of like a person. Me. And you don't. Like you move in a certain way. Hey, remember, I see. It's Christmas themed. I I see your I see Candy Cane. Yeah, she's behind me. Be careful not to touch her. I won't touch her. She's plenty far away. Oh, that's a good guess, Benicia, But you are not a tree. Friends, what is Benicia? Go ahead and say it. One, two, three. Nutcracker. You're a nutcracker. You should have asked if you could crack nuts. I, think well, that I don't would... think she thought of that one, but that would have been a good one. All right, friends. Good job. We'll have to play that again sometime. That was fun. But let's go ahead and move on because I know my littler friends, it's hard to sit for a long time. So we're going to move on. All right, so I muted everyone so you can just hear my voice, okay? Thumbs up if you can hear me. Thumbs down if you can see the truck. Thumbs down if you can see the truck. Good, all right. So, Let's take a look at this picture. Look at the picture for a second. Not of the rabbit, of the people. That's great. I didn't know you could search for all rabbits. So, do you think the learner or the little girl in this photo feels like her teacher, the lady behind her, enjoys working with her? So, does the learner feel a connection with her teacher. Thumbs up for yes, thumbs down for no. Why it doesn't know, that's okay. It's okay not to know. It's hard to tell from one picture. It looks like most of you said yes. Good, Lavea, do you wanna tell us why you think that? Because the teacher is um, smiling and, and um, really concentrating on the project that the little girl is doing. Yeah, she's like kind of smiling. She's concentrating on what the girl's doing. Good. Um, let's see. Anyone else want to say anything? Cassidy, go ahead. What are they making? Is it a gingerbread girl? I don't know. But what do you think? Do you think that the teacher has, um, a learner feels connected with her teacher? Yeah. Yeah, why? Because they're, 
Because they're working together and they're not like complaining about anything. Yeah, so they're working together. Good. So I, when I look at this picture, I see um, the teacher is being very helpful. She's like Cassidy said, not complaining about anything. And like Lavega said, she's really concentrating on what the girl's doing. She's dedicating her time to that girl. So I do think that little girl would feel like she, uh, her teacher enjoys working with her and enjoys helping her. I would say that. So spending time with your peers, your learning guide, and your teachers make school fun. So we're going to learn ways of how we can feel connected to others at school this week. So that is our theme, is feeling connected. So having that connection where with me or your teacher, or in Levea's case, her learning guide, how we can feel like we belong and that we matter and that our teachers care. So that is what we are doing this week. And Lavea, your learning target will be a little different since you're not in this age range. It's going to be about the same. So my kindergarten, first and second grade learners, you by the end of the week, you will be able to state how you feel connected to others at school. And my third and fourth graders, you will be able to express how you feel connected to others at school. So pretty much the same thing, but state and express. Express. They kind of mean the same thing, but they're a little different. How do you think they're different? Cassidy? I think they're different because like because they like they they make you do like separate things that like like connected and like like state and express like those are like different yeah how are they different like like i don't actually know but i i think I, like state and express makes them different okay you're right they make them different lavea is that a hand up or a thinking hand a thinking hand okay. all right so i will go ahead and tell you and that's okay that you don't know because these are new words and we learn new things every day. So state means you're just going to say something. This is how I feel because. Whereas my older learners, you will say this is how I feel because, but then you will add more information on that. My younger learners, you will say how you feel in one or two words where my older learners, you're going to talk for a little while to really explore how you feel. So instead of one word, it's a lot of words. So that's the difference. Oh, Cassidy, don't be dramatic. I see that facial over there. So this week in Connect You and Levea, yours will look kind of similar. We have the lesson plan. And remember, lesson plan is on top because it is important. This is what we use to know what we're doing each day. And the live lesson attendance is for my kids watching later who aren't here. Explain that one or two sentences about what we're doing. And elaborate. This is where you'll really show your learning target. And express just reflecting on the week. Now, this is important, so show me your listening ears. Good. All right. So, Connects You starts today. It is due on Tuesday, January 7th. Okay? Because next Tuesday is Christmas Eve. I don't expect you to do work on Christmas Eve. I'm not doing work on Christmas Eve. If I'm not doing it, why should you? So you do not have to turn it in on Tuesday. I want you to listen. Put your hands down because I need you to listen. So you have today, 
tomorrow and Friday for school days. You have off all of next week. You have off Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday of the following week. Then you have school Thursday, Friday, Monday, Tuesday. So you have seven school days to do this. If it were me, I would get this done now so I don't have to worry about it over Christmas. So that is your choice. If you want to wait until January 7th at 11.50 p.m. to get it in by 11.59, that's your choice. But I would get it done now. Cassidy? Um, I can show you the actual Christmas song of this hat, like, like whenever you stop recording. Okay, Cassidy, what did I say? Um, put your hands down if, if you want to listen. Yeah, what did I, um, say about Connect Shield? I want to make sure that you heard me. Is Connect Shield, like, we're gonna, like, like, like... Like, what does do, it do? We're gonna do like so the the kindergarten, so the first and second graders are gonna do something. Cassidy, Cassidy, when are you turning it in? I I think I'm gonna turn it in, um, on the nineteenth. I think. When is the due date, Cassidy? Um. The 7th of January. Very good. Thank you. All right. So the code word for my friends who are not here is January 7th. So the code word is January 7th. All right. And Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. And I will not see you guys again unless I have a check-in with you, um, which I have with a couple of you. Um, I won't see you again until 2020. So that's super exciting. Um, this is the end of our lesson, but if you'd like to stick around to read Pig the Elf, um, I'm going to stop recording and then open up a new recording, but you can stay right here and we'll read this. But if you're ready to go, you can click leave meeting, bottom corner, okay? So I'll just give you one minute to go ahead and make a decision. All righty.